Hi, welcome. We are on Arclinux B and we'd like to build our own Herbstluft WM. We kind of like the styling window manager, but we'd like to edit some of the files to, to delete some of the applications and add some of the applications. Then Arclinux B is the one for you. You can install lots of things, Arclinux, ISO, D, the Bs, it's all there for you. The power is there, the scripts are there. Just do what I do. What we're going to get is a code from here. Copy. Put it on our desktop with a terminal. Control Shift V. And yes, you have to be on Arc Linux or Arch Linux. I had this uh, user on uh, Telegram saying it didn't work. He was on Manjaro. No. You gotta be on Arco Linux or Arch Linux to make this work. You need Arch ISO. What you go in, then you go in here, and then you are going to take a look at Herbsluft WM packages, and you say, hey, I would like to have actually GIMP on my machine when I boot up, and it will not be on there because we start with a rather minimal Arc Linux B always. So Inkscape, is that on there? Um, nope, not gonna be on there. So now it's on there. LibreOffice, yeah, good. I want that too, etc., etc. You keep adding or deleting lines just a hashtag away to delete it. Just a hashtag, delete the hashtag, and it's gonna be on your system. Control S, save it, and then it's up to you. Now we're gonna run, run the script. There are two scripts. One is for the very first build of today. If it's the very first build of the day, you use the 30. If you just build one and you want to reuse the packages that you just downloaded, which are still in your var cache pacman packages, which means I'm going to, uh, I do not need to download 2.5 gigs um, from the internet. So if bandwidth, bandwidth or speed of the internet is a problem the second time around, then use, um, number 40, which is not going to download anything. Well, it's gonna download something. This is Herbsluft WM. No, I don't get it. It is not going to download anything. Let's have a look. I've been making videos at, in, in, in an end, in a loop, right? So Arc Linux is, in, is built, Arc Linux D is built, Arc Linux B extended is built, and because of the extended part, ah, still three guys to go and download. That's it. Three packages. Because of all the ISOs I've been building, almost all our almost all our packages are in. These are all the ISOs I've been building, plus the one from Arco Linux ISO, uh, that one, this one, and then also Arco Linux D's. They're also somewhere. This one. So I've been building, I don't know, a lot of ISOs. I think I'm halfway of our 18 ISOs to build. So it's super easy because the, the major part is already here and all I have to do is run number 40 which is going to um, make sure that I reuse the downloaded packages. Number 40 is not going to clean up this guy. So I don't need to download it, it's faster. So I'm going to wait for this to end and then we'll have a look. I don't know if you noticed but just when I wanted it to pause I saw somewhere LibreOffice. So this ISO will include LibreOffice. Here it is, right? Optional dependencies. This is on the ISO. You chose that to be, to, to, to have that present on the ISO when you boot up. Pausing. And we have the results. We have an Arcolinx B, HLWM or Herbsluft WM. The version is 20.2.12 and it's going to be in an Arco Linux B out folder. All the ISOs end up here and this is the one you need to build to do to uh, burn on an USB or to load up in your virtual machine and try it out. These are all the information about uh, the packages. What did you actually install on the ISO? What are the Lego blocks basically? And this is all checksums. So it's time for you to burn. Uh, your uh, ISO to a USB and then revisit maybe the packages file and say I forgot something I'm gonna rebuild it again and um, that's in here that's the file you're gonna re-edit and then uh, 
build it again. Enjoy the building process.